Hey guys, thanks for watching. Got a great video for you today. Beer can chicken in the tandoor oven. Came out awesome. Guys, don't forget to give us a like, leave a comment, and definitely don't forget to subscribe. Step one, got to remove the skin. The oven's so hot, it'll just burst into flames when it goes in. Now you're going to want to sprinkle on some of this tandoori barbecue masala. Great brand. I've been using it for years. Just sprinkle the magic dust all over this chicken. Work it in good and make sure you get it all over. You can even put some inside if you want, I'm sure. This is the chicken rack that I bought. Believe it or not, I paid $7 for this. Worked out great. It was on sale, it was something like 20 bucks, and they had it on clearance for $7. I couldn't pass it up. As you can see, I used a nice German Hefeweizen beer. I would recommend something like that. Nothing bitter, no IPAs. You don't want the chicken to be bitter. So I would stick with something, you know, an Oktoberfest or something like that would probably even be nice. Now, if you haven't caught on by now, what's going to happen is the beer over the fire inside the chicken, the beer is going to steam. So not only are you going to get the flavor of the, you know, the beer, but you're going to get the steam that's going to help cook the chicken from the inside. So it's a win-win. If you never did this, the beer can chicken, you got to give it a try. Fire is ready to go. Chicken seasoned and ready to go. It's time to get this baby in the tan door. Now I'm gonna cover it up and probably let it cook for about eight, 10 minutes at the most and check it out. Now, as you can see, the cover's got a nice crack in it because a nice tree branch fell on it a couple months ago and I'm still using it, but it is not in good shape. I'm already kicking around ideas on how to make a new cover for it probably going to use a big stainless steel 20 inch pizza pan and put some handles on the outside edges of it I think that's going to be the way to go I'm not going to make another one out of concrete for the top oh, shit. well that was it folks that's the end of that cover it's a pretty much a pile of rubble right now all right, let's get this bird out of here. It's been in here probably about 15, 18 minutes. No more than that. Cooked perfect. Unbelievable. 
What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Oh, and by the way, it's uh, about 36 degrees out here tonight. As you guys can see, it just pulls right apart. The meat was so tender and juicy on the inside and so nice and charred on the outside with that masala spice. I, I, uh, it's one of my favorites. Tandoor chicken, without a doubt, is one of my favorites. What do you guys think? Well, here we go, guys. I served this up with some yellow rice, fresh sliced tomatoes, and some chili mango pickle. Finished it off with a nice creamy cucumber sauce. Amazing, moist, delicious, spicy, creamy. What more can you ask for? I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave me a comment. All right, we appreciate it. So until next time, thanks so much.